what's up racers racer beast here and welcome back to another csl2 video now i am here with the 2016 ford gt lm um this car was made available uh, to the players during the america series event and when it comes to the topic of live racing uh this car in my opinion is the best for to use for live racing okay that's because this is a super low pp high evo car um, it builds Tino as well and I have tested this in a lot of lobbies and um, no matter what lobby it is in, um, it just destroys those lobbies if set up correctly. So that's how good this car is. Uh, if you have this car in your garage um, and if you haven't built it, uh, you may consider building this one because it's really worth to invest your resources in. Okay. So with that being said, let's have a look at the live racing setup for this one. Let's have a look at the upgrades. Um, so I have engine at stock, turbo at stock, intake at stage 1, nitrous at stage 3, body at stage 5, tires at stage 3 and transmission at stage 5. Okay, so this gives me a performance point of 645 and an EVO point of 2014. So this is a super low PP high EVO setup. Okay, and as I have said uh, in my previous videos, uh, having such a super low PP high EVO setup gives you a significant advantage when it comes to lobby uh, matchmaking okay so you get placed into lobbies where your opponents are uh, running slower than you and um, you don't get bumped up also that easily so with that being said let's have a look at the tuning for this car um now as far as the tuning goes uh, keep in mind your tuning might be slightly different uh to mine depending upon what fusions you have so adjust your tuning accordingly okay this is just to give you a baseline so for me, uh, nitrous all the way to the right, final drive at 2.41 and tire pressure at 26 psi, okay. So this gives me a dyno of 10.613. So I am aiming for a 10.6 to 10.9 lobby. Um, but as I said before, there are uh, very good chances I can get placed into, you know, slower lobbies as well where I am faster than my opponents. So, um, before we get into live races uh, with this car, let me show you the shift pattern for the same. Let's do a test run. Okay. So, uh, as far as the shift pattern goes, uh, it is slightly different from what you will normally uh, use at max setup. But, uh, in this case, you will need to aim for a perfect start. Okay. And then do an early shift somewhere around a speed of 50 uh, miles per hour. Okay. Uh, hit nitrous immediately after that and then rest all will be uh, deep good or early perfect ships okay so i will show you what do i mean by uh, doing the run now here we go so let's see what we ran there So we got a run of 10.543 with a dyno of 10.613. So this car can beat a dyno uh, by some amount although that run could have been better. If shifted uh, correctly, it can beat dyno by one tenth of a second, okay, at the setup. So yeah, guys, um, that's it for the uh, live race setup for this car. Now I'm going to show you a few live races, but I am going to stop my commentary. So enjoy the live races, guys. This is Risabi signing off. See you in another video. Bye. If I check it I don't know how to feel But I'm not sorry I'm lost in your eyes, are you even real? But don't you worry, I'm not looking for the one No, I just wanna have some fun So let's get drunk tonight, cause fuck how we feel But for now
Enjoy.